I thought you were a cheat, a swindler, but you were right. Lord, light your way. What has spurred his little heart? Ah, my soon-to-be highly coveted elixir. You see, one gulp puts you to sleep, and when you wake up, you are suddenly richer. <laughs> I've not heard this ruse before. It sounds like one I know, and I cannot explain how it works, but it does. Take that gentleman's elation as proof. He and many others have returned to me, all with different tales to tell, but all wealthier in the end. All right. Give me the elixir. I don't have any on hand. To brew this elixir involves great risk. You must be certain you are up for the challenge. Won't know until I hear it. Very well. There are two crucial ingredients you must bring me. Bear testicles and fresh lichen. Where can I find these ingredients? There's a den just west of here where the bears have taken a liking to winter chanterelle. As for the lichen, you can find some growing in the well outside. Be careful. Yeah, definitely not good. Lichen for the alchemist's elixir. Here, I've brought what very good. Let me get one. There we have it. One elixir of miraculous wealth. Enjoy. Looks as though this one took the elixir as well. Ended up here, but could not get out. I should return to the alchemist, see if he knows what happened.
You, alchemist. What happened to me after I drank that piss? How should I know? I told you, I cannot explain how it works. What I can say is the elixir hit you particularly hard. You stumbled out of here, then began sprinting across this forest as if you had a nose for something. Very feral. I was worried, but I'm glad to see you are all right. Your wealth has swelled, has it not? In a manner of speaking, I awoke in a cave beside a dead man clutching some treasure. Hmm. I've not heard that outcome before. One of your customers in the same pursuit, I think. Only he was not so lucky. Perhaps I should shelve this elixir for the time being. At least until I can better understand its effects. Good thinking. <laughs>